Humanity has always been captivated by the idea of flight, a dream that has its roots in ancient history. From the earliest civilizations, humans have looked to the skies with a sense of awe and wonder. This fascination is evident in the myths and legends of cultures worldwide. From Icarus and Daedalus's ill-fated flight in Greek mythology, to the magical flying carpets of Arabian tales, the dream of soaring through the sky has been a constant in our collective imagination. As we transitioned into the Renaissance, this fascination took on a more scientific tone. Enter Leonardo da Vinci, a man of many talents whose curiosity and genius led him to explore the concept of human flight. Leonardo was not just a painter of masterpieces like the Mona Lisa and the Last Supper. He was also a visionary who dared to dream beyond the known boundaries of his time. In Leonardo's extensive notebooks, he sketched designs of flying machines that mirrored nature's most accomplished flyers, birds and bats. His designs were not mere fantasies, but were grounded in careful observation and understanding of the principles of aerodynamics. He studied the wing structures, flight patterns and bird behaviors, and incorporated these insights into his designs. His ornithopter, a machine designed to fly by flapping its wings like a bird, is a testament to his innovative thinking. However, the technology of his time could not translate his visionary designs into reality. His flying machines remained on paper, a dream unfulfilled. But Leonardo's work was not in vain. His bird-like designs and theories laid the groundwork for future explorations into flight. His understanding of aerodynamics, principles of lift and drag, and the importance of a stable center of gravity would later prove crucial to the evolution of flight. Leonardo da Vinci's designs, although ahead of his time, were a stepping stone to the realization of human flight. Fast forward to the 20th century when the Wright brothers turned the dream of human flight into reality. Orville and Wilbur Wright, two bicycle mechanics from Dayton, Ohio, forever etched their names into the annals of history by achieving the once unthinkable human flight. The Wright brothers were not just pioneers, they were innovators, inventors and visionaries who dared to reach for the skies. Their journey began in the late 1800s when they started tinkering with flight designs and conducting a series of tests in their bicycle shop. They meticulously studied the flight patterns of birds and translated their observations into mechanical principles. Their relentless pursuit of knowledge and understanding laid the groundwork for their monumental achievement. The date was December 17, 1903. In the quiet city of Kitty Hawk, North Carolina, the Wright brothers unveiled their creation, the Flyer. With Orville at the controls, the Flyer took off. It only lasted 12 seconds and covered 120 feet, but it was undeniably the first successful flight of a powered airplane. This momentous event marked the birth of powered aviation, and the world would never be the same again. The Wright brothers' feat was more than just an engineering triumph. It was a testament to human ingenuity and the power of dreams. It opened up new horizons and possibilities, transforming the way we live, work, and interact. It brought people and cultures closer together, shrinking our vast world into a global village. It fueled further innovations and advancements in aviation, paving the way for the air travel we know today. The Wright brothers' achievement had a profound impact on society. It sparked a wave of enthusiasm and fascination with flight that continues to this day. It inspired generations of inventors, engineers, and dreamers to push the boundaries of what is possible and to reach for the skies. The Wright brothers' achievement marked the dawn of a new era in human transportation. Their legacy continues to inspire us, reminding us that with ambition, perseverance, and a dash of daring, the sky is indeed the limit. The next leap forward in aviation came with the advent of jet engines. This revolutionary technology was the brainchild of engineers working during the most desperate and innovative times, the Second World War. In the midst of global conflict, the Nazis were the first to develop a jet engine. This was no small feat as the technology required was leaps and bounds beyond anything that had been previously developed. The engine had to be able to withstand intense heat and pressure and yet be light enough to be carried by an aircraft. It was a balancing act of the highest order, but the German engineers rose to the challenge and created a piece of technology that would change the world. In the aftermath of the war, the victorious allies were quick to recognize the value of the German scientists and their work. 
In a move that would have profound implications for the future of aviation, many of these scientists were relocated to the United States and the Soviet Union. In their new homes, the German scientists continued their work on jet engine technology. They refined their designs, improved their techniques, and pushed the envelope of what was possible. Their efforts would ultimately lead to the creation of aircraft capable of breaking the sound barrier, a feat that had once been thought impossible. The development of jet engines was more than just a technological achievement. It was a testament to human ingenuity and determination. It demonstrated that even in the face of adversity, humans could create something extraordinary. It showed that we could push the boundaries of what was possible, and in doing so, we could change the world. The development of jet engines marked a significant advancement, pushing the boundaries of speed and performance in aviation. It was a leap forward that would pave the way for the incredible advancements that were still to come. The quest for speed led to one of the most significant milestones in aviation history, breaking the sound barrier. This breakthrough happened in the year 1947, in the cockpit of an experimental aircraft known as the Bell X-1. The man at the controls was none other than Chuck Yeager, a test pilot who was about to make history. The Bell X-1 was a unique craft, shaped like a bullet and painted a bright orange. It was designed to withstand the immense forces it would encounter as it approached the speed of sound, a barrier that many believed to be unbreakable. But Jaeger, with his steely nerves and unparalleled piloting skills, was undeterred. The significance of breaking the sound barrier was profound. Until then, pilots had experienced severe turbulence and loss of control as they neared the speed of sound. This was due to the buildup of shock waves that formed a sound barrier causing many to believe that exceeding this speed was impossible, or at least fatal. But Jaeger and the Bell X-1 proved them wrong. On that historic day, the aircraft reached a top speed of approximately 767 miles per hour, breaking through the sound barrier and entering the realm of supersonic flight. The achievement was a game-changer. It opened up new possibilities for aviation technology, paving the way for the development of faster and more efficient aircraft. Breaking the sound barrier was like unlocking a door to a new world. It allowed us to explore the limits of what was possible, to go faster and farther than ever before. It also represented a triumph of the human spirit, a testament to our capacity for innovation, our refusal to accept limits, and our relentless pursuit of progress. Breaking the sound barrier was not just a technological achievement, but a testament to human ingenuity and perseverance. It marked a new chapter in our journey to conquer the skies, a journey that continues to this day as we push the boundaries of speed and exploration. As we look to the future, the evolution of flight continues at an astounding pace. It's a journey that started with the dreams of visionaries like Leonardo da Vinci and the Wright brothers. And today, it's being propelled forward by the audacious goals of nations and space agencies worldwide. In the realm of jet aircraft technology, there's a race that's heating up and it's all about speed. In 2023, China unveiled plans for a hypersonic jet. This isn't just any jet, mind you. This beast is designed to reach speeds up to 16 times the speed of sound. Imagine, if you will, soaring through the skies at such a breathtaking velocity. It's an ambitious project, one that could revolutionize not just military aviation, but commercial air travel as well. But China isn't alone in this pursuit. NASA, the American space agency that needs no introduction, is also hard at work. They're developing a supersonic jet aircraft of their own. This isn't about reaching the edge of space or even breaking records. It's about making air travel faster, smoother and more efficient. It's about turning long haul flights into short hops and making the world a smaller place in the process. These advancements in jet technology are just the tip of the iceberg. Beyond the speed and efficiency, engineers are exploring ways to make flight more sustainable. The dream is to have zero emission aircraft, planes that don't leave a carbon footprint. It's a lofty goal, but then again, so was human flight once upon a time. The future of flight is shaping up to be quite exciting. New technologies, new materials and new designs are all coming together in a symphony of innovation. The skies are no longer the limit, they're just the beginning. As we continue to push the boundaries of flight, 
Who knows what the future of aviation holds? One thing is certain, the dream of flight continues to inspire us. From Leonardo da Vinci's bird-like designs to the supersonic jets of today, the evolution of flight is a testament to human ingenuity. This journey has seen the Wright brothers' first powered flight, the advent of jet engines during World War II, and Jaeger's groundbreaking sound barrier break. The 21st century has brought us to the brink of unimaginable speeds, with China aiming for 16 times the speed of sound and NASA revolutionizing commercial air travel. As we continue to dream and innovate, the sky is no longer the limit. Being significantly less fuel than conventional turbine engines. Conventional turbine engines, this achievement not only represents a milestone in aerospace, but also has the potential to revolutionize but also has the potential to revolutionize both civilian and military aviation. Operates in two different modes depending on speed at speeds below Mach 7 it acts. Shock wave stabilizes and concentrates on a circular platform maintaining thrust through an oblique detonation. Oblique detonation almost in a straight line. The reason for this design is its astounding theoretical efficiency, whereas conventional. While conventional engines achieve efficiencies of 20 to 30 percent, this new detonation. The detonation process could convert almost 80 percent of the chemical energy into kinetic energy, marking a quantum leap in terms of a quantum leap in terms of energy efficiency and aircraft performance. Meanwhile, NASA is working on several jet engine projects, including hypersonic. NASA has given the green light to the first phase of development of a new type of engine that uses dual propulsion. Engine that uses dual nuclear thermal and electric propulsion to launch astronauts in large spacecraft at high speed using. High speed craft with minimal fuel use the skies are already the limit, they are just the beginning. As we continue to push the limits of flight, who knows what the future holds for aviation, one thing is certain. Of aviation 